Hello everyone and welcome to this tutorial. In today's video, I'll guide you step by step on how to create an open VPN server and set it up for both TCP and UDP protocols. Additionally, I'll show you how to use a proxy and payload for secure browsing. Whether you're a beginner or someone looking to refine your skills, this video has got you covered. Let's dive right in. Step 1. Download OpenVPN. First, you'll need to download the OpenVPN app. Open the Play Store on your Android device, type OpenVPN in the search bar, and select the app from the search results. Tap on Install to download it. Once the installation is complete, launch the app and you'll be greeted with the home screen of OpenVPN. Step 2. Create an OpenVPN server. Before we start setting up OpenVPN, we need to create a server. Open any browser and type UDP Custom in the search bar. From the results, visit the official UDP website. On the homepage, click on the SSH servers label, then scroll down and click on the OpenVPN label. Choose a location for your server, ensuring it's active, and select a server by clicking on the Create label. Enter a username and a valid SNI, optional. Check the reCAPTCHA box and click Create Now to create your account. Once the account is created, download the TCP, UDP, and SSL config files. Don't forget to save your username and password. Step 3. Set up TCP without proxy and payload. Now let's set up TCP without a proxy and payload. On the OpenVPN home screen, tap the plus icon, then tap Next, and select Browse to import the TCP config file from your download folder. After importing, tap the pencil icon to edit the config. Enter the username and password you saved earlier, then click Connect. If the VPN asks for a certificate, click Continue to start the VPN. Step 4. Set up TCP with proxy and payload. Next, let's use the TCP server with a proxy and payload. Open a text editor app on your phone or laptop and import the TCP config file from the download folder. Edit the config by adding the payload, using the server IP as the proxy with port 80, and putting the host on the server address with the same port. Replace all demo hosts with working hosts. Save the edited config and repeat the import process in OpenVPN. Click Connect to start the VPN. Step 5. Set up UDP. Finally, let's set up the UDP server. There's no need for a proxy here. Simply import the UDP config file you downloaded earlier. Enter your username and password and click Connect to start the UDP server on OpenVPN. Conclusion, and that's it. You've successfully created an open VPN server and set it up for both TCP and UDP protocols, with and without a proxy and payload. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends, and don't forget to subscribe. For